What's going on guys? Today we are out in the wild hunting for sports cards collections. I found one yesterday on Facebook Marketplace. I reached out to the, the person who listed it and I worked out negotiation pretty smoothly. It is a smaller collection than I typically uh, am used to acquiring, but it seems to have a lot of potential. It's about an hour and a half away from my house. Uh, it should be fairly easy for me to sort through this entire collection. I'm super excited about it. I'm super excited about bringing you guys along this journey with me. So yeah, let's go. Uh, let's go get this sports card collection. All right, guys. Here we are. We're back at the house, and like I said earlier, this is a smaller collection than I'm used to to acquiring. Um, it's give or take about five thousand cards, I would say. Uh, I don't have the exact number because it's kind of like uh, spread out. Some in the box, some in these boxes, and then some in the binder. Uh, the cards in the front there were inside of here. They were in there. I took some of them out because they were kind of like piled out where the box was uh, kind of falling apart a little bit. But uh, there was a couple of, of, of signs when uh, when looking at this collection that I felt like there was definite possibilities of some good hits being in here. Um, so, you know, a lot of it, you know, you know, in top loaders, you know, a lot of this was in top loaders, um, in sleeves, uh, was well taken care of. Oh, one of the images had, you know, this set opened up and this is the, uh, the fifth anniversary set. Um, seems like it's complete. So, yeah, there was a couple of telltale signs of it possibly being something that was good. Um, so, I risked it for $200. Um, and, yeah, let's see. As obviously, you can see there's a Jordan right there up front. Um, so, only, only time will tell as we go through this to see what we find. And, uh, yeah. I'm excited about it and I'm happy to take you along this journey. So let's see what we can find. All right, here we go. This is what I have found so far. Just a little bit. Here's a Penny Hardaway rookie card. It's a nice mix of cards. Uh, Alonzo Mourning, Charles Barkley, a Scott Niedermeyer rookie card. There's a lot of hockey in here. Uh, David Robinson rookie, Jamal Mashburn rookie. A couple of these David Best cards. And these were all already in top loaders, which is great. Charles Barkley. Here's a bunch of vintage hockey, which is pretty cool. Uh, they all seem to be so far of the Montreal Canadiens. I don't, I'm not familiar with uh, any of these players, so I'm going to have to look these guys up. But they're all in uh, really great condition because they were in the top loaders. And then over here is a stack of Jordans and Shacks that I found so far. So starting with the face-to-face -face Jordan. Then got quite a few of these 5th Anniversary Jordans and Shacks. I'm going to have to look the pricing on these up. Because I know it's I, I know that 5th Anniversary is a, a variation of that set. Supreme Court Jordan. There's a Shaq rookie card. A ton of these fifth anniversaries and then a shack admiral's choice so yeah so far that is what i found and uh, i'm going to continue looking through here i'm going to look a little bit more through here a little bit more through these piles right here up front uh and i will let you know what i find okay so something pretty crazy just happened um and I am completely blown away. I never expected to find anything like this before, uh, especially in a smaller collection, maybe in a larger collection, but I am completely blown away. Yep. That is a Tom Brady rookie card in mint condition it is in a sleeve in there it is in a top loader it is in mint condition 
Can you believe this? You know, the funny thing is, is the, the, the lady that I bought this from, she said that she had moved from Massachusetts. And, you know, I didn't think anything of it. Uh, nothing came across my mind. I didn't put the dots together. And now I do. Uh, you know, considering Tom Brady's played for the New England Patriots. So she must have been a fan of the Patriots and a fan of Tom Brady. But there is a Tom Brady rookie card. This is absolutely insane. Actually, I'm I'm speechless. I, I jumped online as soon as I found it and I looked it up and this card by itself raw was selling for like almost $300. Uh, PSA 9 was selling for um, a little over 500 and a PSA 10 was selling for between $2,000 and $2,500. That's absolutely insane. I am not selling this card. I am going to get this card graded and I'm going to hold this card. Uh, I'm not a big fan of Tom Brady, but I respect Tom Brady. He, you know, he has changed the game when it comes to being a quarterback in the NFL. So this is absolutely insane to find. Like I, you know, when I, when I buy these collections, you, you never know. It's a hit or miss. Like you use some of your, your ability to be able to, to spot things and, and some of your knowledge to be able to, to, take an educated guess on finding, you know, something good in, in, in collections, uh, just based off of going off of pictures or a description or, or going to see the collection yourself. But I never expected this. This is absolutely insane. I do not have a Tom Brady rookie card. This is my first Tom Brady rookie card. This is bonkers. Like I cannot believe it. Um, I'm going to, uh, end the video on this note. <laughs> I have still a lot left to go through. Maybe, maybe there's another Tom Brady rookie card in here. I have no idea, but, uh, I, I don't know how else to help end the video. You know, nothing's going to top this as of right now. So, uh, so yeah, um, this goes to show you, you know, doesn't matter the size of the collection. I've bought a million card collection. I found amazing cards in there. 200,000 card collection. Uh, you know, a few thousand card collection. This is about a 5,000 card collection. And there was a Tom Brady rookie card in here. Absolutely insane. So thank you guys for watching. Um, make sure you stay tuned. Subscribe to the channel to stay updated for, for more uh, treasure hunting through these collections. Uh, you never know what you're going to find. This is absolutely insane. So make sure you subscribe. Make sure you smash the like button. Uh, leave a comment below. And... Uh, I'll catch you in the next one.